Yo, what's up guys? It's Vid and today we're gonna be talking about Squid Game. I just finished watching it recently with my girlfriend and oh my god, it is amazing. And I was watching it and I was asking myself the whole time, obviously the money is not worth it compared to the amount of trauma and death and human lives that are lost throughout the film, obviously. But to make matters even worse, I asked myself at the end of it, 46 billion won. Is that really worth it? Well, let me tell you why it's not worth it, even remotely. Even if you are at rock bottom, it's not even worth it. 46 billion won is equivalent to, if you're in America, 36 million dollars. 36 million dollars. That is not as much money as you think. When you consider that there are apartments in New York City that literally go for 50 million and up, and there's a lot of them, by the way. They, I'm not saying there's like a handful. There's a lot of them, okay? There actually is a lot, and they're way more money than just 50 million dollars. It's really not a lot of money. It, definitely not for Squid Game. The amount of mental stress and drama and death that has that happened in the movie in real life would absolutely not be worth it. And I'm a little concerned for the people that are watching that are like, I would totally risk it. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, life is beautiful. Let's just talk about the reality of how little $38 million actually is. Now I know it's extremely privileged to say that $38 million is not a lot of money. Me personally, that is more money than I could ever imagine at the moment, right? But is it worth what you're put through? Considering the average American makes roughly three to four million dollars over the course of their life, they average, okay? That means there's a lot up here and there's a lot down here to get that average. But three to four million dollars is what you can make. If you make the right decisions and you invest and you create a business, or if you focus on your own life and you go and get your dream job, not only do you get happiness, but you'll actually make enough money to live happily if you can work it out and it's completely possible when i was watching this i was saying you know obviously the people in the movie are extremely extremely low in life i mean they they set the the plot of the story is set on absolute de desperation in, in completely i mean the main character of the movie literally punches his daughter's stepdad in the face and then like ruins his entire relationship with her before they move to America. It's pretty intense and you can understand why the premise of the story is created the way it is, but I wanna make this video just talk about the fact that 46 billion won is really not worth the mental toll of what actually happens in the film. I personally could see a trillion dollars being like, wow. And I, obviously there's no dollar amount I could ever put on this. Um, I, I love life and I know there's ups and downs in life and that's my true beliefs. I'm sharing my beliefs with you, the way I run my life. We all have ups and downs, uh, but at the end of the day, you're alive and if you didn't die, the next day you can try to fix whatever happened. You, can, you, can, you have a new page each day. So if today wasn't perfect, tomorrow may be better. And that's the way you have to look at things. So even in this scenario that, <laughs> Their lives, all of the characters' lives in Squid Game, all their lives are basically falling apart. Uh, they've stolen, they're criminals, they're uh, in serious debt addictions, uh, alcoholics, drug addicts, all that. Um, it's completely possible for them to dig their way out eventually. So to throw your life away for $38 million, $28 million, 46 billion won, to me is just mind blowing and absolutely unnecessary for you to do that. Now, it's a movie. I know, I'm saying it again. I know, it's a movie. I can already see the comments. It's a movie, I know, it's a movie. I'm making the video to just address that it's not all, it's, it's a lot of money, but in the grand scheme of things, it's not a lot of money. There are literal apartments in New York City that are worth double of what the prize money is for Squid Game, the entire thing. So just to buy the apartment, not even to pay for it, just to buy the apartment is worth double what you're gonna win from Squid Game. And people buy that, which means there are people with that much money. So to say that you should risk everything, no, <laughs> no. So yeah, Squid Game, really good series. If you haven't watched it, you definitely should. I'm pretty sure they're coming out with another season at some point. It's totally worth watching. Just 
check it out. Guys, if you want to see more content like this, smash the like button, hit the sub button. As always, it doesn't cost anything to be kind, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.